Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 1.26 p.m., and it's Monday, May 30th, 2022. I didn't go to work today because today's Memorial Day, it's a holiday, so you know what I mean? But anyway, so I got a three-day weekend, but anyway. Um, I finally got the last two flavors of the True North Pure Energy Seltzers. I got them at the Aikens Natural Market in Bixby. Um, it was like right around $2, so I guess okay priced. Um, at Walmart, it's a little bit cheaper. Um, they're like $1.25 at Walmart, so definitely try to get these at Walmart. Um, I also, my local grocery store, Homeland, also carry these drinks, but only two of the flavors. Um, the, like the cucumber lime one, and also the, um, black cherry one, so you know what I mean? But I mean, anyway, but yeah, I finally got this one, so I'm going to be reviewing it today. This one sounds like it might be pretty good, too. We shall see. Anyway, today I'm going to be, re be reviewing the Mandarin Yuzu True North Pure Energy Seltzer. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that can. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. I don't know what's been wrong with me, but the last few reviews I've been forgetting to do the thumbnails, and also in my Naruto G Fuel review, I forgot to read the nutrition facts. Um, so yeah, so hopefully I don't mess up again anymore. We shall see though, but I'm anyway. Uh, so we're talking the silver tab. What was the Best Buy date and production code? Best Buy May 2023. So it's still fresh for a while. I like the colors of the can too, with the white and the orange. Looks pretty cool, you know, just saying. But um, yeah. Right on top it says Mandarin Yuzu, True North, and it has the logo, it's like a compass with the big M in the middle of it. It's like a textured can, it looks like the Monster Zero Ultra cans, because it's white and it's like textured. And it has like this cracked ice look, a little bit like the older um, Rockstar Pure Zeros, and that's what this can reminds me of anyway. See what I mean? But anyway, Pure Energy Seltzer, Artifi I mean zero artificial flavors or colors, zero sugar, sweetener, and calories. 12 fluid ounces, 355 milliliters. Energy for the journey, immunity support, plant-based energy source, non-GMO, gluten-free. Shows like an arrow, leaf, and like a DNA thing, and like a wheat thing. Simple ingredients help increase alertness, concentration, support immunity, and reduce fatigue without calories, sweeteners, or sugars. Has the Ardog Group logo, some other codes, and the SKU, truenorthenergy.com. 0% juice. Nutrition facts are in size 1 can amount per certain calorie 0, total fat 0 grams 0 percent, sodium 0 milligrams 0 percent, total carbohydrate 0 grams 0 percent, total sugar 0 grams, with 0 grams added sugar 0 percent, protein 0 grams, vitamin A 25 percent, vitamin C 25 percent, niacin 80 percent, vitamin B6 80 percent, vitamin B12 80 percent, pentothenic acid 80 percent, zinc 50 percent, and then it has other ingredients, carbonated water, natural flavor, organic panax, ginseng extract, organic caffeine from green coffee beans, zinc gluconate, bisorbic acid, vitamin C, organic green tea extract, Niacin, cinnamide, citric acid, decalcium pentothenate, vitamin A palmitate, zincomb aluminum, pyridoxin hydrochloride, organic guarana extract, organic guayusa extract. Yeah, these drinks have the organic guayusa extract, but um, it's interesting that these drinks, you can't taste the guayusa. Like a lot of the drinks I've had before, like they had the guayusa, like the runa drinks and stuff. Um, they had like a strong, earthy, herbal taste, and I didn't really like them. But um, yeah, these have the guayusa in them, but you can't taste the guayusa, so that's cool. Mm -hmm. Manufactured for True North Beverage, LLC, 44752 Morley Drive, Clinton Township, Michigan, 48036. Um, maybe Missouri, though. Can't remember. I think it's Michigan, though. It's MI. Has a recycling logo, cover 2021 True North Beverage, LLC. Organic plant-based energy blend is Panax Ginseng, Caffeine, Gran, and Guayusa. Caffeine from all sources, 120 milligrams per can. So, oh yeah, boys, it will get you lit. Get you lit, you know, just saying. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Seem responsibly and recommend for children, people since caffeine, pregnant women, or women who are nursing. Um, so, yeah, this has like a lot of organic ingredients. That's why it was at the Aikens Natural Market. Um, but yeah, you can get these at a lot of places though, like Walmart and Homeland and stuff. So, should be able to get it pretty easily though. But um, my Walmart doesn't carry these, and neither does my other grocery store in the town. The only place that I've seen this flavor, and the one that I'm reviewing in my next review, um, the only place that had them was the Aikens Natural Market. But I don't know if like Whole Foods started carrying these the drinks or not. I haven't been there in a little while, you know, just saying. Um, but they might have started carrying them though, but I'm not for sure. Um, but yeah, you can get these at the Aikens Natural Market. I don't know if they have these at the natural grocers either though. You'll just have to look, I guess. Sorry about my lighting, I'm in the shade right now. I have my car's air conditioner on a little bit. Um, Cause yeah, it's like 82 degrees it says on my car, but um, it feels like warmer than that though. Okay, 
Okay, the other ingredients. It's a little bit reflective. Sorry about that. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can. So anyway, I'm gonna show it off up close real quick, so hold on a minute. Okay, I showed off the can up close and now I'm going to shake it up a little bit, open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on a minute. And yeah, it's a seltzer. You probably don't want to shake it up too much, but you know, I'm a renegade. I'm just running in, but I'm anyway. Got some napkins just in case. Hope I can open it. Okay. And yep, even though it's like um, a seltzer. Actually, this one doesn't look that carbonated. Um, maybe a little bit, though. Um, but yeah, the color is clear and artificial colors. So, I'm not starting to bubble a little bit. I don't know if you can hear it too much when the car's air conditioner on. But ASMR. Um, but yeah, anyway, the smell. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah. 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 Well, well, well. Very strong citrusy smell. Definitely very mandarin. Definitely orange. Um, I only had one other yuzu drink before. It was a citrus yuzu, a marquee energy drink. Um, this is like an exotic fruit sort of flavor. Um, so this has that smell a little bit though, but um. Actually smells a lot like the um how the strawberry dragon fruit um great value energy juice drink um tasted that I reviewed earlier today. Um it smelled a little bit like how that tasted. Like a um strong exotic fruit sort of taste. Definitely citrusy though. Um but yeah, it still smells pretty sweet though. But yeah, definitely a strong pungent scent. Um but yeah, anyway, and I'm gonna try it, so here goes. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Definitely way better than the grapefruit one, but um, I don't know. I still think the black cherry one might be my favorite one of these. This one's still actually really good though. I also like it better than the cucumber one. But yeah, it's like a seltzer, so the flavor is a little bit light. But um, it's still sweet though and pretty good. It does have a little bit of that like um seltzer sort of aftertaste. Like a little bit like a sparkling water, but um, yeah, this is also like a sparkling water, and so um, it loses its flavor pretty quickly. So you gotta drink it pretty quickly, you know, right after you open it, because if you leave it setting out for a while, it'll probably lose its flavor, you know, just saying. Um, but yeah, the flavor is actually pretty good though. Definitely a very tropical, <clears throat> orangey, citrusy sort of taste. See what I mean? It's pretty good. I like like orange flavored drinks and like um you know mandarin and stuff and like um you know like other citrusy drinks. But um this one's actually still pretty good. Um I don't know if I can really taste the yuzu. I could smell the yuzu a little bit. Might be able to taste it a teeny bit though. But um might taste it a little bit like the um citrus yuzu marquee. But that was more like a little bit like a Mountain Dew sort of citrusy flavor. But also a little bit like exotic citrusy. See what I mean? But um. Yeah, um, the mandarin orange, though, overpowers the yuzu in this drink, though. But, um, you can definitely smell the yuzu, though. Um, but, yeah, you, um, mostly just taste the mandarin, though, see what I mean? But, yeah, it's still pretty good, though. It has a really cool can design. I like the colors of it and stuff. Um, it's okay. Price is, like, right around $2 at the Aikens Natural Market. Um, I think it was, like, 2 for three fifty, I think, or something like that. They're on sale, though, but, um, 
try to get these at Walmart. If your Walmart has these drinks at my Walmart, they're only like a dollar twenty-five or so, so pretty cheap. Um, so yeah, definitely try to get it at Walmart or other grocery stores in your town or whatever if they carry these. Um, but yeah, um, it's still pretty good though. Definitely tastes really good. Definitely like it better than the grapefruit one. But um, I don't know. This one, the flavor is a little bit light though. Um, the black cherry one I think is my favorite because of that one. I don't know. The flavor is like way stronger in that one though. I don't see what I mean. But um, it's still pretty good though. But um, yeah, not my favorite one of these, but it's still pretty good. But yeah, energy-wise, it has 120 milligrams caffeine. It has a B vitamins and stuff. So, oh yeah, boys, it will get you lit. It will get you lit, you know, just saying. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. So, probably shouldn't drink and have any anxiety problems. But, um, um, these don't mess with my anxiety too much, though. See what I mean? Um, compared to, like, other energy drinks. But, um, so energy-wise, it lasts about two and a half hours, about four hours of energy. So, oh yeah, boys, it will get you lit. It will get you lit, you know, just saying. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. So, it works pretty good. As it has a cool can design. It's okay price. Tastes pretty good. But, um... Um, yeah, this one and it has that um, sparkling water aftertaste. It's a little bit more noticeable in this one. Um, but yeah, the Mandarin stands out way more than the Yuzu, but um, you can definitely smell the Yuzu, so, you know, I wish I could taste the Yuzu a little bit more, though, but it's still pretty good, though. Um, but yeah, definitely highly recommend it. I'm going to give the Mandarin Yuzu True North Pure Energy Seltzer Energy Drink. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's still lit. So, oh yeah, it's lit. So, oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Oh yeah. It's a cool can design. It tastes good. It works good. It's pretty cheap. See what I mean? So, definitely try it. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. You anyway, my next review, I'm going to be reviewing, I think it's the white peach flavored one. Stay so tuned for that review. So, I'm going to review some more videos. Just watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.